Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Um, today is actually really nice and cool. Um, it's about 10 o'clock in the morning and um, we got the thunderstorms um, yesterday afternoon and um, we got a, a boomer overnight too. So that bed is about as ready as it can be and um, the slips have plenty of roots on them. So um, I've been out planting this morning, so why don't we go ahead and get to that footage and then I'll be right back. Okay, as promised, we got thunderstorms yesterday afternoon and um, we had a few overnight. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this planted. That's pretty good and wet. Once I get them in, I'll probably um, give them a good spritz of fresh water. But that ground is nice and moist. They should enjoy it. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do these kind of like um, a square foot garden. Kind of exactly the same way that um, I did the other bed. But I'm going to come in and I'm going to make an indent here. About six inches all the way around. And then I'm going to make, um, as I go through and put them in, I'm going to put them in every 12 inches. But um, I'm going to start off <clears throat> just making a mark around the edge. We need to move those before I kick them over. Okay, now I'm going to come in and I'm going to make another mark at about a foot. Um, I want to be in at least a foot to do the center. We'll put a few holes in here so I can reach up in there and get a few in the center. It's kind of a long stretch, but I got that dirt exactly the way I want it, so I don't really want to get up in there and make a mess. But I do have all of my slips, and you can see they've they've all got some really good roots in them. So we're going to start working on getting these guys in here. And uh, I'm going to start in the center. I can always add more, but 
We'll make sure to get all of those roots down in the ground. They should really enjoy that nice, nice moist soil. That's just wet really far down there. I got all of those guys in the center, so I'm going to start working around the edge. Make sure you don't miss anybody. And um, I'm just going to go about a foot. About a foot apart. And that's pretty much how I want to have it set up. So I'm going to go ahead and put a break in here real quick. Um, so you have to watch every single one in, in slow motion. So hold on just a second. Okay, I've got everybody in here planted, and um, I'm going to um, go get the hose, and I won't make you sit through that. I'm going to give them a little bit extra water just to be sure for today. And um, I put the extra slits that I have, um, not very many, but I do have a few. Um, I put them back in the jar of water because they can sit there for a few more days. Um, most of the ones that I was picking out didn't have as many roots as the ones that I planted. So I'm going to let these others sit in a jar for a couple of days and give these guys some time to um, take off. And if I have, <coughs> excuse me, the humidity today is just terrible. Um, if I have anybody that has a failure to thrive issue I can always come out here with a few extra starts but I'm going to go ahead and get these watered and um, then we're going to probably leave them for most of the day and I'll check on them again tonight and um, bright and early tomorrow morning okay so that's all the footage that I have for today but I'm really happy to have um, an extra bag of sweet potatoes planted and um, it's good and soggy wet so um they should have 
no trouble, but you know, they might try to be pathetic for a day or two. But um, we'll check in on them again this weekend when I do um, just a, a regular update. Um, kind of thinking maybe I might still want a few pumpkins, but I certainly can't put them out in one of those big beds. Um, they don't get a whole lot of shade, which is why the, the sweet potatoes do so well out there. But um, I do have a bunch of beds in the raised bed garden, and um, I'm going to try to get them planted probably tomorrow while it's still cool. And um, I have one bed out there that gets a pretty decent amount of shade, so I might try to put in one small bed of pumpkins. But um, certainly this year I don't think it would have been very feasible to... Um, put them in that big bed right out in the middle of, of the bright sun. Um, anyway, um, probably might have to rethink that come next year too, but um, at, well, <laughs> you know what this year's been like, I'm not even going to try to predict next year, so um, anyway. Um, I got a, a few beds to get working on yet today, and um, it's going to stay nice and overcast and pretty cool. Um, all of today, so I'm going to try to get in as much work as I can. Um, not really fond of the humidity, and um, the mosquitoes have torn me up this morning, so um, I'm going to take care of that too. Anyway, I um, should probably go ahead and get out of here. Um, if you're not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. Don't forget to ring that little bell to let you know um, when I'm digging in the dirt again. Um, if you have any comments, questions, suggestions, anything on your mind, please leave them in the little box below. And if you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, don't really have much more to say, but I think I'm going to get in um, out of this humidity for a few minutes and um, get out and get back to work. But anyway, um, I'm going to go ahead and let you go. Don't forget, we love you, and we'll see you in the next one.